Hi, my name is Adhiro Nicolau. I graduated from the English School in 2008. I then went on to do a BA in English Literature at Cambridge University at Trinity College and completed my graduate diploma in law at the BPP College of Law in London in 2011. Since then, I've been doing a PhD in comparative literature and film at Harvard University. I really appreciated my English school education for a bunch of reasons, but the two most important ones were the extracurricular uh, activities on offer at the school and also the fact that the school is a bicommunal um, school, one of the few on the island. When it came to extracurricular activities, the environment and the opportunities offered by the music department, the English and Greek drama clubs, but also the debating society were very formative to my experience, not only as a public speaker, but also in showing me how the arts are extremely important in a person's lives, but also in education. Um, as for the bicommunal aspect of the school, that was integral in forming not only my personality, as, uh, as an individual, but also my political perspective, something that I think is extremely important uh, in Cyprus. My name is uh, Alex. Um, I graduated from the English school in 2009. Uh, came to UK to study electric electronic engineering at the University of uh, Nottingham. Uh, following my graduation, I'm now working in a software engineering company in, based in uh, Loughborough University. Going back uh, uh, regarding the uh, English school, uh, uh, as a prefect also, uh, I remember the uh, warm and nice uh, environment of a multi rich multicultural environment that the English school uh, embraces, uh, trying to teach students uh, respect to each other. In addition to the great uh, education that provided me the tools to come and study here in UK, uh, and achieve my uh, degree and uh, what I wanted to do. Uh, I believe that uh, um, the English providing the extracurricular activities and all these uh, social events and the, uh, the very rich program that it has after school has uh, helped develop me as a person. My skills from the debating and gameplay and such workshops that I, I used to go and uh, take part in. And also as a prefect helping other students promoting uh, awareness and uh, anti-drug and things like that. So I believe it's, it's not only the education level that was really helpful at the English school, but the whole environment with friends and all of this package was really a great experience for me before coming and helping me prepare uh, for UK. Hi, my name is Nasia Haji Georgiou. I graduated from the English school back in 2006. Um, Immediately after graduating, I went to UCL, the University College London, to study law. And after I finished with my undergraduate degree, I studied uh, for my master's in law at the University of Cambridge. Then I worked for a year, and during that year, I decided I wanted to become an academic. So I went on to do my PhD at King's College London. And shortly after that, I came back to Cyprus and became a lecturer in law. I, I teach constitutional law and international law at UCLan Cyprus. I think my time at the English School helped me become the professional I am today in two main ways. The first one was the extracurricular activities we did here. So when I was a student, I was a, a member of the debating society. And through that society, I was given the opportunity to go to the World Debating Championships in Canada. And I was also uh, given the opportunity to go to the Hague International Model United Nations. And because I loved uh, time so much, together with a group of friends, we decided to start the Mediterranean Model United Nations, which took place for the first time in 2006 at the English School. Today, when I have students coming up to me at UCLan, um, telling me that they participated at Medimon and they loved it, I feel extremely proud of what we did and what the school helped us uh, do 10 years ago. Um, the second thing that I think the school helped me with was the teaching experience, um, was the experience with the teachers I had. Uh, the teachers were amazing and I think the attention they paid to each and every student 
helped me get the marks I needed to get to go to the universities I finally attended. I'm a ceramic artist and I make these pots. Um, I call myself a ceramic artist because I feel the pots have a sculptural quality and they, they're not really for using to put your salads in and things like that. Um, what else can I say about my work? It's inspired by my life in Africa. I spent many years living in Kenya and also in the Middle East. Um, and also from my Mediterranean background. The English school was left a lasting impression on me. The happiest of memories in spite of being there during the most difficult times in Cyprus' history. Lifelong friends, solid education, you felt that you could leave the school and do anything you wanted. In fact, I had no intention of doing any art. When I left school, I did other things first before I became an artist. And I think it's a, it's a school that gives you roots so that you can fly. So, my name is Nicoletta. I graduated from the English school in 2008. I studied law at the University of Cambridge and then I proceeded to do a master's at the University of Durham, which I really enjoyed. I'm now back in Cyprus. I trained as a lawyer. I'm still working as a lawyer in the field of intellectual property. I think that the English school really helped me, both academically and on a personal level, to prepare for university. It got me in, into great universities by giving me firm academic foundations. It allowed me to develop on a personal level by providing me with a variety of extracurricular activities to participate in, um, like choir. And it also gave me good skills for my, for my career development by allowing me to participate in international events like MUN, like debate club, all of which are of course vital when practicing as a lawyer. I was really pleased to see the way the school has developed and I can, only con I can only hope that it continues to provide both academic and extracurricular opportunities for generations to come. My name is Dimitris. I graduated the English school in 1993 and then went on to study finance and economics at Yale University. Following that, I did a master's in finance and economics at the LSE. I currently work for the Bank of Cyprus Group and hold a CFA charter. My academic experience at the English School has been a key contributor to my ability to enter uh, and succeed uh, at elite universities in the US and the UK. Friendships created during my time at the school, especially through my participation in the hockey team, have grown and developed uh, through the years into family friendships. During our gatherings now, uh, we very often reminisce of our good times at the English school and uh, look forward to our children entering the school at some time in the future. Hello, my name is Panos Ikonom. I am a general surgeon and I work in St. Anastasios Clinic, which is a specialist surgical clinic in the center of Nicosia. I'm also a clinical associate professor at the medical school of the University of Nicosia where I teach surgery and I'm also in charge of the department of surgery. I also teach anatomy. I've got fond memories of, my, of the English school. My school taught me how to learn. My school also helped me achieve the high grades that were necessary for me to get admission to the medical school of my choice in the United Kingdom where I studied medicine and trained as a general surgeon. The school also taught me how to continue to learn throughout my career by doing self-directed learning, which is crucial for all professionals nowadays. My school also provided me with lifelong friendships with special people from all ethnic backgrounds. My name is Christopher Kazantzis. I finished the English school in 2001. Since then, I became a member of the ACCA and the ACA chartered accountants and I did a master's in England on risk management. Since then I've been working with PricewaterhouseCoopers in England and in Cyprus and currently I'm teaching professional studies, ACA, ACCA for students and I specialize in management and audits. One of my best experiences at the English School was completing the Duke of Edinburgh Award 
which gave me the opportunity to become more independent through the hikes, through community service, being able to help people. And now I've got the opportunity of coming back to the English school and helping the current students do the same thing, helping out with the Duke of Edinburgh Award. My name is Gerkem. I graduated from the English school in 2008. After graduating, I went to study physics at Oxford University. And afterwards, I did a PGC, a teaching qualification at King's College London. At the moment, I'm working as a private tutor in London. I teach uh, maths and physics to mainly A-level students. And also, I'm running the physics and maths tutor website, where I help A-level students with their studies. Studying at the English school helped me a lot, both academically and in terms of extracurricular activities. Academically, I had um, uh, solid A-levels because I was studying at the English school. But um, in addition to getting good results from the exams, we were, um, we were taught uh, how to think in a broader, a broader way and we were seeing a lot of applications of what we were learning. So that was a really good experience for me. In terms of um, extracurricular activities, there is uh, a lot of options a student can get uh, in the English school. I, I had the chance to go to South Korea as part of a team representing Cyprus in the International Young Physicist Tournament. It was a great experience. It, um, it helped me see other people, other physicists from, uh, from all over the world. And um, in addition to that personal experience, it was also really helpful for uh, getting into my course at, uh, at Oxford an active member of the Under the Same Sky Society, where we run workshops and discussions about various topics, and in particular the Cyprus problem. Overall, I can say that the English school provided me a really broad uh, experience of school life, both uh, academically and in terms of non-academic uh, activities. Hello, I am Andrew Labitas. I studied economics at UCL, University College London. I am a partner at Pricewood House Coopers, and actually our office is now very close to the school. My work involves a very large degree of judgment, uh, professional judgment, and I feel that this has developed over the years through experience and through education, and my education started at the English School in Nicosia. I loved being a student at the English school. Actually, I think they were perhaps the happiest days of my student life. I had the opportunity to uh, have a very high quality education, uh, I would say excellent education. And then I also had the opportunity to, to make the best friends that I had over a lifetime. I also want to mention that my, I had my happily my sons, uh, all three of them went to the school and they came out with the same um, conclusions. They, had, they made the best friends and they had the top, top education. My name is Adele. I am an English school graduate. I left the school in 2006 and uh, today, ten, 10 years down the line, I am a television news journalist in London and I work for an international news agency. So the education I received at the English school I think was a very well-rounded education. It covered a broad range of skills, a broad range of subjects. We were always encouraged to explore our talents and our abilities, no matter how different they were. The subjects I chose at A-level stage were not the most popular ones. I chose English literature, history and design and technology. But I am very grateful that I had the option to do those subjects because I feel like they have helped me learn how to think critically and to question things, which really helps now that I'm a journalist. And they opened a window into an outside world that is not necessarily always accessible to a teenager growing up on a small island like Cyprus. So, you know, when I left, I didn't really know what I wanted to study and, or what I wanted to become. But those subjects and my education in general helped set a very, some very solid foundations for my life and career now. I am very grateful that I at least had those options and, you know, they were there for me to take.